my first guest tonight can be seen as Neely Capshaw, the bad girl on Baywatch, the most popular television program in the world. They told me to say that. Please welcome the very beautiful Gina Lee Nolan. Terrific. Thank you very much. Because you, I want to bring this up right away. It's amazing yeah. to me. You had a baby, I think, since the last time I, I saw you. I had a baby. Well, not just. 11 months ago. Four hours ago. Like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Only a woman on Baywatch can do that. Oh, believe Have me. Baby we can, and then, we can do anything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> no, uh, he's 11 months old. I cannot believe how quickly time passes. It's amazing. He's already starting to walk. Really? So, yeah. What, at 11 months? Yes, 11 Is that months. Actually, normal? That's kind of crazy. No, no, no. He took his first step at 10 months, or nine and a half months. So. And now he's doing flips. Like he's an incredible months. kid. What can I say? Yee. What? Uh, now was the birth? Was that? Was that a okay? Everything all right? Everything was, that scary? was perfect. You know, I had my mom there. I had my husband there. And uh, we were all so into it. I mean, it was, it's such an intense moment anyway. When you're, when you're getting, I wouldn't want a lot of... laughing. Wait, okay? wait, you, you, that's a lot go of... Go and give birth and then, yeah. That's then a lot of spectators, you think, you yeah. know. Yeah, well, you know... Come on in here, everybody. <laughs> that, no, that's what my doctor thought. I mean, it was insane. My husband's screaming and pushed and, and he's sweating. And, and at one point, my doctor just turned to him and said, Shut up! You know, like, let this woman have the baby. And, and uh, so it was, it was pretty intense. It was yeah. fun. And, and it was you, fun, though. You had the baby, and then uh, anything else happened? Anything no, unusual? Um, no. One thing that I did do that probably most mothers would not do is uh, I took my placenta home with me. Now. No, <laughs> no it, folks, it comes with an Let's easy carry <laughs> handle. You know? Hi. I like your purse. No, it's placenta. It's placenta. If you if you're out there um, in the cosmetic world, listen. There, um, everything that's in cosmetics, a lot of things uh, have placenta in them. So I wanted to take it, you know, to plant a tree for Spencer in his honor. So plant that's what I what did. What kind of tree did you? So you, you put it near the roots? Come on! What? So you, you put the placenta. I I, I what kind of tree orange, was it? An orange tree, and I have like. I don't want to eat juiciest. that orange. <laughs> I have the juiciest. Mm, placenta eat. <laughs> no, that's what I thought, and I, you know, Does it the, affect the, the taste of, of the orange. No, it, it's it's like it's nutrients. It's vitamins for your plants. So what can I say? You're crazy. <laughs> All right. Uh, speaking of. Uh, Speaking of uh, babies and such like that, yes. and your husband, you yes. got married on the show. I did. To, yes. to uh, Mitch Buchanan. Mitch Buchanan. A.K.A. David Hasselhoff. David Hasselhoff. Yeah, uh, yeah he, is, uh, he is my husband on the show. And, That's kind uh, of a big age difference between your characters, yeah. isn't it? <laughs> oh, he's, no, he's a friend of mine. He's been on the no, show. He's no, told he me he's 62 years old. Yeah, he's, 62 years. <laughs> he's very upfront about it. He fought in the I Korean did, War. He's a brave that. military hero. No, we did get married, and everything is, is fine and, and well. Um, but it, our characters together, um, they decided that they want to sort of do our, our separate ways because he is an old guy. <laughs> uh <-huh. laughs> no, um, You're going to get fired. <laughs> <laughs> no, and actually, uh, You'll be the selling only placenta ones. oranges any time. <laughs> One of the lucky ones, thank God. But uh, uh, but but, <clears throat> but anyway, because um, your character is very yeah, evil on the show. Yeah, I mean, I play this, you know, the sort of uh, run around Sally. I go with all the other characters, <laughs> you know. So it's only fitting for me and, and him too, because he's never been married in storyline uh -huh. to do our our own thing. So it should be interesting. Okay, what's he like? Uh, he was on the show yeah. uh, just like two weeks ago or yeah, something. Yeah, I know. Actually, I just missed him. I was here as well, um, just a few days before them. Yeah. Well, he was telling us that he just, you know, made a fortune on the show. He made like five hundred million dollars or yeah, something. Yeah, that wouldn't surprise me. Yeah. Now, is he a, that would make him a great gift giver, I would think, on the set. What kind of gifts does David Hasselhoff give away? Amazing, honestly. They are, honestly, they are like a family there. I mean, Baywatch has been really, truly amazing to all of us. Specifically, I mean, it, it what is... kind of gifts does he give? To you? <laughs> Curious. No, what? I mean, we get, we get, you know, raises, and we get, um, uh, so, some of us do, and, and, uh, <laughs> and, and, um, and one, <laughs> yeah. get fired. Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. Um, 
but uh, one year I remember it was very nice. Um, we got uh, a leather jacket that was really cool with Baywatch, and and uh, it was inspired. That's advertising so. for the show. That's not a yeah, gift. Yeah, but it Wear is. this <laughs> jacket that says "Up with David Hasselhoff." <laughs> David, I appreciate no, this. No, it was, it was very nice. I'm very proud to, to say that does I he ever, was a does, part of the show. Does he ever give, like, CDs away of his music? Um, he's a, no, I mean, you know, he's, he has really made a big mark in Germany and in Europe, for that matter. He is, you He's know, huge in Germany. He's a giant star in Germany. You have, you have no idea. I mean, it Excuse is Excuse me, I do have I a big don't. idea. <laughs> I have been to Germany. I have witnessed it. No, when we People get just, the place, they have statues of Hasselhoff huge. over there. It is absolutely huge. It, it's phenomenal, the show, and him. I mean, they, they really take, you know, the whole show very, very, very seriously. So. And he's got a big music career there, too, huge. which is incredible. It's like, it's like Elvis. I mean, he, they just, you know, they absolutely adore him. So it's, it's great. Yeah. yeah. Oh, I, why would you think that I wouldn't know that he was a big star in Germany? I mean, that's, <laughs> like, that, that's something that everybody no, knows. No, I mean, it is. He is, he, but he's ultra big. It's not like big. He is like, he's huge. It's of Hasselhoffian proportions, he is, Yes, hassle hopping. Okay. Now, uh, I want to ask you about Levi's. Now, you're wearing Levi's here on the show. I am wearing Levi's. And I understand that there's some connection between you and Levi's, which we yes, need to discuss. Yes, I am here in New York City to promote the 125th anniversary of the invention of the blue jean. So, and that is a big thing to celebrate. Yeah. Levi's. So, and we have, a, we have a special promotion going on. Um, throughout the nation that in 10 different cities actually where they're giving out free Levi's 5,000 to anybody with the name Gina, Jean, um, Eugene, anything. So if Jean, you can, if you can Jeanette. prove, Jeanette, um, if you can prove that your name, middle, first, last, doesn't matter, you get a free pair of Levi's. What if an Italian baker came in and said, I am Mr. Ginelli, would he get jeans? Ginelli would get a pair of jeans. Now, doesn't Absolutely. that alienate everyone who doesn't have that kind of, I mean, that, yeah, that makes a lot of people really angry. You can't give, you know, the whole world, you know, a, a free pair of jeans. You have to be very, you know, has to be very precise. I so. think they could if they really tried. Well. <laughs> You're getting nervous. Yeah. <laughs> There's a Levi's guy watching right I, now. Yeah, have right. him destroyed. <laughs> the red-haired one proves troublesome. <laughs> yeah, um, yeah, right. I can see that. Uh, now, how do people, I mean, anyone could go into a store and say, mm. okay. my name's Jean. Anybody can do that, but this is the kicker. You have to prove that your name, you have to have a passport or driver's license or whatever. And also what you can do, if you're not in one of these 10 cities, you can uh, link up to the internet, and that's www.levi.com. And then that way you can do it as well. So no one is left out. Okay, except people that don't have Jean in their name. Right. Uh, <laughs> right. And I think well, they're screwed. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, yeah, I that's guess That's so you're strange right. that you're, that they, they pick someone from Baywatch to yeah. market jeans. Because yeah, you guys are famous. Jeans, yeah, right. you don't wear well, pants. That's like... Know, it's, it's, seriously. Some people that are famous for not wearing but, pants to market jeans. Do you like the way I look in these jeans? Oh, you know so? I do. You, you look fantastic. <laughs> you look great. That wasn't fair. <laughs> you like the way I look in these jeans? Going back in time to high school. All right. Uh, <laughs> tomorrow at Levi's New York City stores, 12 to 1 o'clock p.m., and of course on Baywatch. Yes. All right. So. On Baywatch. Yeah. Well, thank you very much for coming yes. by. Congratulations yes. on your new family. Thank you. What did you thank name you. your baby Jean or? Spencer. Oh well. Spencer. <laughs> I love you, Spencer. Spencer isn't going to get any pants. All right. <laughs> Gina Lee Nolan, everybody. Buddy Cole is coming up tomorrow.